Larry, if you're going to say something that you feel like you had a bad experience on, don't use something about toilet talk. Sorry. <sighs> As we're still trying to thin Iris to see what Larry witnessed the whole night thing with Bikini's words said, prove her innocence against Francisca, the judge, the younger brother's whole thing is a judge for the day. Uh, Phoenix is recovering, etc. Good who knows where. No more worry about Maya and Pearl. What does Mia Spear have to say about all this mess? Gumshoe thing. Hopefully discover more after these three done their parts. Oof. Welcome back to the gaming's of Ace Attorney Trilogy of the third game. Trial and Tribulation of this last episode here. We got some parts so far. But we still need to know all the basics of it. I'm running my patience, you know. I know I leave. <laughs> Well, if you like that paint, I guess it's still, it's still safe, baby. You get my description here. You want to own it, Coraida? Come on, really? So, there was a missing 15 minute prior to the meeting Phoenix Wright. I hardly see that as much of a problem. Yeah, not much of a problem at all. Really? The bridge is burning before your eyes, and there is a phone right next to it. Why then? Did you not report the accident? accident? Yeah, Larry! The type of drinker wants to know this too! And keep most of the people in mind. We're worried about two of the cousins that are in danger, mostly Maya as well! Who knows where Pearl is? Yes, witness! Why didn't you? You were you there simply to watch the bridge burn? That's kind of messed up if you did. And there then lies the problem. For even after the bridge had burned out, he was still there. Staring into space, this witness didn't even accept, attempt to fulfill his heavy duty. That's what it sounds like. Uh, but this is Larry we are talking about. And even he is incapable of being so stupid. Which means there has to be a reason for his insection. I think it's about the time I got serious with you, dude. You sci fi, you've been playing with us. All this time. Well, Listen, I'm going to tell you everything. Are you sure you want to hear it all? I sound crazy because no one believes me. Yes. Okay. Upper most. Let's see. I may really be excited for this as much as you can. Oh, hey! Then say it! Don't spray it! Especially that paintbrush. Very well. I have a terrible bad feeling about this. However, Let's have the witness finally give us the whole truth. Now, for this 15-minute gap, what were you doing, witness? Say it likely. The missing 15 minutes. What? When more the time go? I am the Alexia. I am an artist. What do you do? I was doing sketching in front of the bridge. I was whipping up in uh, into the frenzy of art. A shot I owned, uh, and I was feeling... Transfer it all directly on the onto the page. Before I realized it, the police have gone up, out, and then he came running up. He asked when he fell. Uh -huh. Hmm. I suppose artists can be strange. Oh. That's right. I'm willing to sacrifice everything in order to draw the perfect sketch. Including the truth from the sound of it. <laughs> there, there, Edward. Mr. Edward, has this removed the last of your doubts? Not at all, you remember. One very large doubt still remains. And what would that be? This is a surprisingly believable story, especially considering the source. So why did he think he needed to hide it from us until now? I intend to drag the reason out of him. <laughs> You'll regret this, Eggy. Maybe? Oh, okay, here we go. One, two. Hold it. Sketchy. The burning bridge. That's the best of doing the situation. He thought someone's gonna die when he crossed it. Though. The burning bridge and everything that came with it. Uh, what came with it? You want to hear this from my lips, do you, Eddie? You'll regret this. The sketch of mine is out. Enough. Just take that ridiculous sketch of yours out already, witness. It's kind of cute when you do like that. Oh, oh, what are you talking about? I don't know what you mean. Oh, come on. That doesn't indeed appear to be the fastest solution. I'll leave it to you, Mr. Edward. What should I do? God, it's a terrible feeling that the instant the sketch is revealed. The entire world may be changed by what it is 
expected there. Look at the sketch! You have to take it! Alright, I wonder if you could show us your sketch, please. Oh well, even if I couldn't have imagined it turned out like this, imagine what? Now, if Laura Stevens, the doubt, would take place here, but it like this! Oh, 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 oh. Show it! Yeah! Okay, okay, let's steal, your steal yourself! This is the world of Laura and Demaxia! Oh, that's actually a pretty good picture. An atmosphere as I've seen scenery with your own eyes is somehow the dead. Whoa! What? Looks like someone fell into the bridge or something while it was burning! Is it? I, I don't know. Look at it differently. Yeah. Was someone falling or flying? I can't really tell. Okay. What? <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. Look at Oh, 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 um, well, uh, so this is, is Dusky Bridge, correct? Why a large bridge? Is it your response, Miss Von uh, Yes! Well, uh, God help me. It, it's a better drawing than I expected. Is, is it? I struggled to re re reproduce those flames. I really did. Yes, I'm sure you did. I had to go along with that. Uh, yeah. Ugh, this is going to get ugly. No one has the courage to spring it up, it seems. This, this mysterious flying object. Larry? What? You're burning, the burning bridge is gone. But, what is that unfortunate looking figure? Oh, you spotted that. I thought you might. However much I might want to ignore it. Iris, of course! Iris! I wish she takes better care of herself. We have to plan for our future, you know? Not happening! What would have happened to her if she had injured herself long like that? Larry, please answer this next question, honestly. Okay! Are you really claiming to have seen this? Are you claiming to have seen the silhouette of the defendant flying over the bridge that was in flames. Yep, that's what I saw. That's why I drew it. I'm an artist, a real artist. I'm an artist. You? Hi, that the girl. She really high uh, it, up in the picture. Why? Why? It's a big boo. Oh, what's more? Yeah, yeah, that's what I want to know. This is all a bad dream. I was seeing you on the cheat to test the theory. Did you just do it with your fingers pinching his cheek? My way's better. Uncertain people. Okay, okay. Don't don't want to make like. Ugh! Please whip your own cheek from now on, if you, on if you wish to test your wild theories. Anyway, no court of law will ever acknowledge that people can fly. No, you're right. Unless they had a a jetpack or or a glider thingy or a, ben, a bungee cord rope. Well, I guess maybe not under pressure, but that's my point. Actually, there is some predicent for this. She was flying pretty high, my sweet Iris. She was about 30 feet above the bridge, at least. It was really something to see. This is, has to be some kind of mistake. Miss Erdogan, please bring the witness back down to her. What? Me? He's not... Not... He knows it's not a term, literally. It's just saying with another word to it. This witness is your friend, is he not? According to court accessory to foolishness, smiled Edra. Let's, let's get back to cross sandwich. By force, if necessary. Sure, Edra, I expect you to expose the obvious contradiction here. Yes, Your Honor. Looks like I've got another reason to remove this Well, what do you think of my debut? Get the big, get the big witch. Larry sketch added to the poor record. Horrible sketch of what he saw the night of the crime. Eh, alright. Still, there is something off the point. Now hurry up and cross the damage. Anything else you want to add? Please. I saw Iris flying. Her white hood fluttering. Ah, but here's the thing. 
didn't have it because she gave it to Phoenix! Catch you now! What? I have to scull with the phone and listen. Larry, what did you really see that night? Not that I particularly care. In your position, that's just being irresponsible. I drew exactly what I saw. I'll give you the whole dollar that it's the truth. If that is truly the case, then there is one thing that we can say for certain. What that what might that be? That person who flew over the bridge could not have been the defendant Irons. What? What do you mean? I don't understand. A foolish Harley fully well, a foolish statement by an a fully foolishy full hardly fool. How exactly can you make this play? Tell us, Larry. According to this picture, the individual who you saw, you say you saw, was wearing a hood, correct? Of course he was. That rundown shack uh, is quite a way from the bridge. The hood is what told me that it's this glowing angel was my iris. The hood is my darling iris, and iris is my darling hood. There are bigger fools in this world than the one at the fences. Brutch, Larry, there's something you need to be made aware of. On the night of the murder, Iris was in her but she had given it to right as a gift. And if we are going to change your story now, perhaps suggest it was right who took flight. What are you talking about? I think you understand what. I mean, it's fine. Fine! Why do you think have Iris' hood? What? Eggy, what's going on with Iris and Nick? Why are you ringing? You dog! They're a couple, not you two! Get a grip, Iris is seen as a friend! Caught! I do believe that this unbelievable, mysterious sketch is destined to disappear, discriminating, and declared straight into the garbage. <laughs> ah, oh, okay, stop. What is it now, witness? It feels like I've been waiting 25 years for this very day to come. Maggie, today is the day I get to complete simplicity you. What? Not even a word. Who's our meaning of your outburst witness? I hate to have to do this, but I have some definitive evidence. Evidence? Evidence? Iris did indeed come flying over the bird bridge. And I, Laura Steve Fitzio, shall prove it! What? I didn't expect to ask this one, but we shall be needing your testimony once again. Tell us how you think you know a quote, considering the defendant has slightly in a sketch, and show us your evidence that this nightmare was actually reality. Okay, I hope you're ready, Eddie, because I'm going to beat you to a whooping serving of pain! Good words. You've been serving us a whooping serving of pain of this whole time. Trust me. I keep it. Proof that Iris flew. Like what? When I reached Dusty Bridge, she was already gone. I was so worried, so I frantically searched all over her. That led to me finding a beautiful crystal spear half buried in the That's the Amethyst Pearl thing that was part of the staff by Ellie! That came off the staff! King thing! I'm sure that Iris was simply wearing a spear hood. But after all, no one else could have lost a crystal spear that night. Oh, it's also part of the hoodie as well with another A crystal sp spear? No, this one. Pretty, isn't it? But finders keepers, loses sweepers. That spear. Where did you find it? Uh, let me see. Around here somewhere. Looks like, looks about right. It was half buried in the snow. It was ha it had a pretty much stopped snow snowing by then, but there was still some fallen as I walked to the to the bridge. Hmm. The court accepts this crystal spear. That's mine, okay? I want it back afterwards. Hmm. There's something on it. 
<laughs> oh my! It's blood! I think I was wearing a napkin, but still. What? Blood? Twisted spear. Found half covered in snow near Dusky Bridge the night of the crime. Has blood on it. Yep, plain as day. You're ready, Iggy! But by tomorrow morning, you'll be calling me Master Larry! Yeah, I kind of like the sound of that. No one is going to push me around anymore. Didn't you want to be called Lawrence T. Maxim only a few minutes ago? Make up your mind, Larry! Okay, here we go. One, two, three. You can show anything the statements could be three, four, or five to present. They just staff photo of Elias or Elias the Mexican profile. So I it. Her profile. Objection! Ta da! Larry, that night, there was someone, someone who also lost the crystal spear. I knew it! It was? Who? Who was this stupid idiot? It's Elias and Demexium, the mentor to this a stupid idiot. The victim? I have a photo of her here. Yep. And on the end of her staff, you can see a familiar looking crystal spear. Really? That's my photograph! Give it back! A crystal spear like that is quite easy to find. I have no one just like that it on my bunch. There will look. They look nothing alike. <laughs> Maybe she's jealous. In any case, please take a look at this. This is the bit of staff found at the scene of the And there's no spear on it. Oh, the crystal spear is gone. What? 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 Is it what? Just what does this mean? Anyone jumps or flew across the bridge that night? It certainly was not Iris. Yes. She was not wearing her hood. More important, the crystal spear found at the landing site was not hers either. Ooh, now, we go. That means, no, the one who flew and dropped that spear was the victim of Miss Ellie's devastation. Oh, what? A fool alongside another fool on a fool's errand to reach a foolish conclusion. First of all, this which I prefer to call it. It's ridiculous. People cannot fly. This it is rejected. You can't do that. Come on, two dollars. And it's crystal spear. Nothing more than a red hair. You honestly believe that? Give it some thought, and I'm sure you will realize it as well. Smiles Alessia de Alessia Gomezio. It was in her room all on the night of the murder. There was no reason for her to go to that Therefore, this fear cannot be related to this case. That is all. Really? This Francisco von Karma, the only people who will accept that observation and scatter brains are in the ground. Why are you pointing at me? The victim's crystal spear was found near the bridge on the night of the murder. Yet you expect us to believe that this has nothing to do with the case? That's crystal spear. It was probably thrown away at the bridge after the murder. After the murder? There is blood on the crystal spear, isn't there? This naturally suggests that it was thrown away after the murder took place. The killer placed it there to throw the investigation off the scent. Which is exactly the same reason that he drew that ridiculous sketch. Yeah. What? You mean... Mime the killer? Ah! All joke aside, from inside, just when did the crystal spear appear near the foot of the bridge? Unless this can be proven in some way, I refuse to believe this is related to the case. She makes a valuable point. There is no evidence that Elias Demexian left her Hazakura temple that night. However, if someone somehow this crystal spear can be proven to have dr been dropped before the victim was killed, then this case is going to transform into something entirely else entirely. The response, Mr. Edward, I want your final opinion on this professional 
mention of this crystal stick. If it's not related to the case, then this witness who we saw will be nothing more than a mental waste of time. Prepare yourself for some very incriminating punishment time, Edward. Is that the crystal spear was dropped before the murder took place? Yes, I. Right would do this. Your Honor, allow me to prove something to you. I will prove that this crystal sphere is a vital link to solving this case. You will, you will do that? That look in your eyes will remind me of Phoenix Wright when he is cornered. That should come as no surprise. Right. Because right now, I am Phoenix Wright. I am I hope for you to present your evidence, Edward. Evidence that proves that the crystal sphere was indeed dropped before the murder. Presents either the crime photo or the crystal sphere. So I'll choose this one. Take that! Take that! This crystal sphere, it was half buried in the snow, correct? That's right. If it hadn't stopped snowing when then it would have been a good one. The snow would have totally covered it. That's all I needed to hear from you, Mary. Your testimony testimony makes one thing quite clear. What? When the crystal spear was dropped, it was snowing, even if it was ever so slightly. Snowing? On the other hand, let us look at the scene of the murder. Ah, it proves earlier today there is no snow on the victim's butt. Oh! Indeed. Therefore, the crystal spear must have been dropped before the murder. What? <laughs> order, order, order! On the night of the murder, the victim did indeed go to the dusty bridge. And there, something occurred that caused the staff crystal spear to come to loose. What? Gotcha now! Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, 
one that's silly now. There is one way that a body could have been killed. Ah! It could also have used to carry a bot. This is completely acceptable while Edward. You have dug yourself into your own grave. Was the only one who could have used the snowmobile was the defendant. He's the one who moved the bot. Doesn't that put a smile on the nail in your coffin? <laughs> You're too late. Francisco Bon Karma, and in fact, the defense has proven something else entirely. We have shown that this case requires further investigation. What? Where was the Elias did not see it. If her body was moved, whatever. And finally, just what does this mean? Eric, do you even need to think about that? Such a creature could never see the truth, or let alone drip describe it. Objection! Objection! This witness certainly sits on one of the lowest possible branches of humanity. However, he would never alter a lie that could hurt a girl he's with whom he is admired. So it he knew this so it is something that actually the Bennett stands for on this point. Thank you, thank you. It's me a little harsh, I want to take your word for her Nikki's bread. Then, that sells it, then. I cannot give a verdict under these circumstances. Err! And it's still working. Wait, wait. Hmm. Right. I seem to have fulfilled my part of this. It is just as I thought. Francis of Aunt Karma, you make a wonderful part. Excuse me. There was more. One, there was one reason and one alone. We be to dispose of Dr. Sunny in this case and then pass it on to Brent. Really? That's what this is all about? You could have just told me that from the very beginning. <sighs> I wish you'd catch up soon, Larry. You should have paid attention. I should have known it was part of the game. Ah! Miles, Edward, I don't care about what you were here to do. Me. Keep my word for it as a proof. You know, Mr. Phoenix, right? It was okay. Most of you to bow him again. This is, was my chance to finally grind you under my heel. I'm ashamed that your chance seems to have slipped by you by. Hey, Shavy! My Shavy! It's all your fault! Such a terrible witness! You are an heir to all the witnesses who are the <laughs> Again! Larry, keep up yourself! Cool. I cannot believe that the witness testimony relates to the, the, an actual event. However, there are, has to be some sort of answer for the questions that arises. Have his words here today been the truth or lies? More truth behind the world than Next time we gather in this courtroom, those are the matters that shall be addressed. I am counting on the plural investigation by both the defense and the prosecution. This rests up to the right. Good luck to the end. That's right, you're gonna need it. I shall battle you, Miles Edgeworth. Where is our journey? Hey, I did it! Ah, get your painting out of here, will you, Larry? I might right, be, don't worry. Well, the rest is up to Phoenix now. More on this later? I guess so. More to do with the ECI, I guess. And until next time, we see Train Series fans out there. And the trilogy itself to the third game of, of uh, Trials and Tribulations. Back to investigation we go. Hoping this is feeling a bit better to do so. Hope you've been eating well, get enough fluids, and take care and warm up, okay? Next up, more questioning the other witnesses. Iris. Larry, Bikini, go shoot Edgeworth. Oh, I think he's gonna help out. Hopefully, the five Pearl and Maya soon. Maybe we'll see Mia's turn again. As well as, you know, Godot's gonna probably face them afterwards. 
But don't worry about the younger judge. The other judge will come back later. I'm just saying. What are the spirits waiting and lying within the areas of this area of the shrine, etc.? I don't know. Maybe Iris is onto something. Can I go have a taste of Ghostbusters like? Maybe not much of the new movie that's out, but whatever. See that?